Did any of you ever wonder what is done to make sure we get pesticides free fruits and vegetables from the markets? Clean, unpolluted drinking water from the environment? How much time and effort is required to perform such tasks to yield this information? How much effort and time of, is required for different analyses to comprise into a blood test report? All of the before mentioned are part of analytical chemistry, a branch of chemistry that has a significant role in almost all aspects of life. One of the main goals of analytical chemistry is to quantify matter, for which a combination of methods and instruments is used for analysis. Many methods coupled to instrumentation have, have grown old over time and are having a hard time to keep up with newly imposed requirements. Don't worry, solutions are everywhere around us, and many of us are working on raising the standards. For example, we are focused on coupling a unique method, a method capable of combining a couple of laborious steps of analytical procedure into a single, simple step to a microfluidic open interface for instrumental analysis, thus simplifying the overall procedure. Typically, other methods are overly concerned with maximizing the enrichment of molecules of interest from, for the analysis, which is often laborious, time-consuming, while for us it's enough to take a very small, negligible amount of molecules initially present in the sample. In other words, just take a snapshot of the system. The reason behind is that enriched molecules will be introduced to extremely small volumes of analysis, thus making the concentration for the analysis same or similar with respect to traditional methods, but in some cases greater. This allows for smaller and smaller concentration of pollutants, pesticides, drugs to be identified. All of this is done by using devices with varying geometries, having a touch sorbent with high selecti selectivity towards molecules of interest. These devices after enrichment of molecules from a sample are introduced to the analysis port by stopping the background solution inflow in the matter of seconds we can aspirate the volume from the analysis port and enriched molecules of interest for the analysis. However, the big picture behind this project is to enable such capabilities for high throughput analysis. Quality control laboratories are swamped with number of samples to run every day to ease their load our method can, e can easily be fully automated and adapted for high throughput format, unlike many traditional methods currently used. In the end, imagine the benefits of four quality control laboratories using these analysis methods, which can offer even on-site inspection of health of living animals, contamination of fruits and vegetables with pesticides, uh, check water quality, and bring almost instantaneous results for all of the above. Thus, making sure that everyone around is eating and drinking clean fruits of nature. Thank you for your attention.